This episode of Liquid Ladder was brought to you by Honey. Few things get people as mad as a pizza debate. You could slap someone's mother right in front of them and they'd still be angrier about a difference in pizza place preference than the slap on their own fucking mom. Pizza is one of those things that people feel the need to defend with their life. It's like knight's honor where they'd sacrifice themselves to make sure to protect the integrity of the pizza place, its reputation. People go to war over pizza, and the battlefield is always bloody, full of gore, limbs, and tits everywhere. And today, I decided to put myself in front of the firing squad here in Goatsy, let it all hang out, and accurately put all of these major pizza chains on a tier list to objectively know where each one of them ranks because we don't make mistakes at the liquid ladder. When we do a tier list, where that falls is where it deserves to be. No arguments. So get ready for the truth. I hope you can fucking handle it, pussy. Do you want to start with Papa John's? Yeah, go for it. Okay, that was my favorite pizza. You gotta unseal it. Yeah. Can you I want me to unseal it? No. Can I just rip it? Yeah. And the answer is yes. Did you feel the flavors just pile out of the seal? You want to like kind of tip it and show it. Yeah. A quality pie, nice symmetrical. Do you remember when John Schnatter went on air about how aliens made him be a racist and like the day of reckoning was I do coming? I remember that. Yeah. All right, ready? Yeah. Are you... Share some oils. <laughs> yeah, there we go. It was grosser than it should have been. Mm. That John Schnatter makes a quality pie. He may be racist, but he knows pizza. <laughs> okay. Uh, if you say so. It's just the better ingredients, man. You can really feel it. What's our criteria? Like mm, well, cheese, full flavor, mm, sauce. Mm -hmm. I think we just go by, does it taste good? Mm. Kind of the scale I'm working on. Right now the answer is like a resounding yes. I've never tried their jalapeno. Should we do the whole package, like with the sauce and everything? Sure, we can try the sauce. <laughs> Not the jalapeno? Uh, well, you can eat the jalapeno. I'm not gonna share a jalapeno with you. Why not? I just, I don't think it's a great idea. To wow, that's really mild. That's one of that's, the most mild jalapenos I've ever had. That's your kind of pepper. That's a good pepper. It's like a bell pepper, if it had like a little teenage <laughs> angst to it. Like it's a bell pepper going through like a phase of rebellion. Nice, that's a, that's a good jalapeno. Can I just say I'm excited to be at this table not in pain for this episode? Mm -hmm. This is the first time that we haven't done a painful one in a yeah. long time. I'm just enjoying food. This is so much better. Enjoying it for now. You're yeah. enjoying it until you get to Pizza Hut. <laughs> <laughs> Papa John's in a surprise to no one. I'm just going to be giving an S tier. It's just the most consistently decent pizza. Yes, it's not going to blow your fucking mind. You're not going to take a bite of Papa John's pizza and then piss your pants because it's so good or like, you know, have a transcendent experience where your soul leaves your body because the flavors just fucking killed you or anything. It's just a consistent good quality pizza now john schnatter aside that guy's a you know the guy's not really a good guy but his pizza it does kind of slap so i do think papa john's pizza does deserve an s tier because i've never had an experience where i take a bite and i'm disgusted it's always been good like all of their different wacky goofy pizzas that they offer all of them are just pretty solid and now, speaking of solid, it's time to talk about honey, baby. I'm sure by now most of you know that I use and like honey. If you watch the podcast, you know I've talked about it quite a bit with my friends. Honey is a free browser extension that you can install in just seconds, only a couple of clicks, and you can install Honey, which will allow you to add coupons automatically to your checkout across a multitude of different stores, online stores. And during checkout, there'll just be a little pop-up letting you know, hey, there's some coupons available for this, and you save money for free. It's free money, basically. I just used it on Amazon recently because I made a purchase through Amazon. It wasn't for the Moby Huge or anything, but it was a smaller purchase and I saved like $10 off the cards I was buying. Like it's actually just an incredible service. Like there is no reason not to own Honey since it installs so quickly and is free and just saves you money. So if you're interested in trying Honey, you can go to joinhoney.com slash penguinz0. That's joinhoney.com slash penguinz0 to try Honey. This is my least favorite, not only my least favorite pizza place, but honestly one of my least favorite foods of all time. Pizza Hut. Like this, everything about it insults the senses. This gross ass fucking plain box. 
This it's just terrible. Now I already opened this one, and I think you're going to be more disappointed than you normally would be with pizza. I don't think you're gonna want to eat it after you see that. What happened? Just really analyze this pizza. You're looking at it. There's zero percent chance a piece <laughs> comes out that way. Oh, I see what you're saying. See, Something is off with this pizza. Yeah, so this little... Here, wait, don't the, move it. Let's show it to them oh, okay, real quick. Yeah. Tiny is above, though. Did, did he get aerial footage with the yeah, drone? Yeah, I guess that's fair. I probably didn't pick it up anyways. Is that drone footage? Yeah, it makes no sense. Yeah, that is kind of weird, It's right? almost like the, as cooking it, they pushed the crust in. Are you taking that little piece? I don't know. I don't that's know. the one they fucked with. I wouldn't touch yeah, it. Yeah, I'm afraid to. Yeah, that's the scary piece. Just look at how gross it is. The way it dances is insulting. Yeah, it's just... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, we had to get a medium. That's right. They were the ones docking more points here. Yeah. You need $10 for delivery, and their medium is $9.99. So we were forced to get the 60 cent ranch pack. <laughs> yeah. And there's no way they didn't plan that. That was yeah. malicious. It, it was. In the small piece, because I'll take the small one from the other side. I'm not eating that, no. Okay. I honestly think that's just somebody here's slipped a, that in. Here's a small Yeah, they were like, shit, we didn't do enough, and pulled one out of the fridge. Or the dumpster, knowing Pizza Hut. Oh, you want to make him kiss again? Yeah, here, slow. Oh, yeah, smack my pizza. Crust. Nice. I'm always shocked every time by how bad it is. It's crazy. I kind of like it. <laughs> how do I know? <laughs> I, I, I already saw that coming. Does it taste like it came right straight from Target? It tastes like the chef bent over and slapped his ass on some oil. Yeah, but like a good-looking chef. Maybe, <laughs> I, I guess. But hold on, is the chef a man or a woman? Mm. I can't quite taste it yet. Mm. <laughs> I will agree with you. I think the cheese is good, but when I got to the sauce, that sauce is terrible. Well, I mean, every... So, there's no there's no distribution here. Mm. All of my All sauce... All the sauce was at the back. It's right yep. here. So this is nothing but cheese so on I think bread. I, I rated cheesy bread at the tip, and now it's pizza at the back. The crust is worse. I liked the cheese, though. I'm not going back on that. Hmm. That sauce is shit. It's terrible. It's really bad sauce. I don't even think they use tomatoes. They use, like, actual just crushed up crayon paste. To be fair, if there was no sauce on this pizza, it would, it would be, be better. The cheese is good, I'm telling they you. They should just rebrand it just like a cheesy bread factory. Mm -hmm. I actually think maybe the or sauce is what kills it. buy your sauce from Papa John's, but keep everything mm. else the same. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. So you were slightly surprised that it was better than you thought? I was. So the first bite had sauce, mm. which, is oh, why which, I is why which is why I fucking hated it. But then as the sauce faded away into just, like, I don't know if the camera can see it, but there's literally no sauce. It's yeah, cheese there's parts of it in the back. It's not going to focus on it. Here, yeah, just get up there in the microscope camera. Yeah, so there's, like, actually no sauce on the majority of the pizza, which is good. Yeah, it's, it's better a, without sauce. It's a blessing. But then when you get up to the only place here with sauce, you hate it. So like that's, a, that's a decent bite. And then the crust is good, but then once you accidentally find some sauce yeah. here, game over. If you're watching Pizza Hut, just get a new sauce and you're S tier. Well, a tier. A tier. Yeah, that was a little I turned that back, I'm sorry. That was a little I'm generous. Sorry. I think this pizza game had no sauce on it at all. It's pretty good. So you probably don't like it. Yeah. They should change their slogan to, you can out pizza. Where is, where is pizza hut? Yeah, Let's do another dissection there so you can see the complete Yeah, you know what? Why don't we lift the cheese off of one of the pieces mm, to show? Yeah. We have the technology. We yeah. can do that. We have hands. Right. So I'm thinking, not that one. That one looks good. This, this looks like what we were experiencing. Yeah. So here, we'll just kind of push this down. You yeah, think? just derobe her. All right. Ooh, that's hot. Oh, that's a good showing for what we're talking about, though. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. There's yeah, no there. sauce. You can't even tear the cheese off. Yeah. Look, there's actually just no sauce in there, except for one part of the. Time. Yeah, one part. <laughs> we weren't lying. No, I'm, I'm serious. That worked out a lot better than I expected. There's no. So I don't know. If, oh, here. You just hold it. Hold it up like right here. That good. Yeah. Hard this camera. Oh, sorry. It's like cartoon pizza, but they forgot to draw the sauce. Yeah. The cheese is great. You know what the cheese reminds me of? The cheese from Chuck E. Cheese Pizza, mm -hmm. which was always solid. Wait, we should order that too. They don't deliver. <laughs> All right, so this is Papa John. Oh, oh that's so that's much better. That cheese slides sauce off with that sauce. 
Look at that. Oh, I don't even have to do any more work. It's, it's doing gonna it for me. Gravity's going to take it. Right after it. I get that little piece. There we go. See? That's sauce. Yeah, just compare Here. the difference. Jeez. It's like a blister That's at different terrible. stages of healing. Wait, which is at which stage? This is at a... This is like you need to go to the emergency room. Oh, it's infected. like you've gone to the white of your, yeah. of your muscle. Yeah. Gotcha. And that's also emergency room. <laughs> if you look like either of these pizzas, go to the hospital. All right. In the interest of fairness, I'll be completely transparent. When Pizza Hut had no sauce, I did actually enjoy it. I would give Pizza Hut an A tier only in the situation where they forgot the sauce. When there's sauce on the pizza, the entire fucking thing is ruined. The sauce is absolutely abhorrent. It's like the chef just cut himself like it was a satanic ritual and just let his blood drip all over the bread. It tastes abominable with sauce. But when it's just cheesy bread, it's pretty good. The cheese in the bread is actually very solid. So since we got a sauceless pie for the most part, I'll have to give it an A tier for this uh, tier list. I was blown away. Shocked. I guess most of the pizza I was getting from Pizza Hut all my life had sauce on it and that's what was holding it back. That was what was ruining it all. Now I see the truth. Look at that wonderful packaging from Domino's. What's their slogan? We fucked up a million times, but still don't uh, forget about us. I don't know what they have a slogan. Well, every every single commercial starts with "We're sorry." <laughs> we <laughs> That's true. All right, so our formula was bad. The ones I used to do, if it didn't get to your house in thirty minutes, it was free. That makes and sense. And then they stopped doing it because I'm guessing that they, they stopped fucked being up. Able to do that. <laughs> now, right off the bat, you can tell oh, there's yeah. some some flavoring on the crust. Yeah. There's like some. Some garlic, maybe garlic parm on the crust. I can appreciate that. Yeah, it looks good. It so, looks whereas flaky. most pizza places, they make it, take it out, and ship it, they at least came back for round two and yeah. put a little Rub fairy... Rub their hands on the outside. Yeah, fairy dust yeah. on it. All right, you go ahead. I, I like the look of this take piece right here. This one was speaking to me. How, how the fuck do I place an order here? Ready? Yep. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, okay. Right. Oh, I have to order some pizza. Hmm. Soft. Wow, that's pretty good. Mm-hmm. This is their normal pizza? Mm-hmm. What are your initial... Very surprised. Uh-huh. Last time I had Domino's was like two, two or three years ago, and it was not this good. You know, it doesn't take a lot of effort to bite. It's softer. Yeah. It's just begging to be eaten. You know what would make this really good? Pizza Hut's cheese. I think um, that would be a... You're starting to Frankenstein together <laughs> some abominable creation. At the end, we'll create our perfect pizza with the best parts of each. That's a good idea. Well, by then it'll be too dry. That's mm. probably... We've got microwaves well. <laughs> and water. Yeah, I think right now, overall, this is my favorite combined. Papa John's had my favorite sauce and Pizza Hut had my favorite cheese, but this is best overall in my mind right now. I'm actually totally on that team. This is really surprisingly good. Wow. The seasoning on a crust does make a difference, too. No, it's it pretty good. It amplifies the enti entire experience. It's playing a wonderful mm. tune on my taste buds. Danny, you're in for a treat. Mm hmm. But we might finish it all. They really did improve, man. All right, I'm going to rip this one now. Okay. Just start it at the top here. It felt like there was a nice even layout of the sauce. It looks like it too. Good ratio of one sauce per one cheese unit. Can you see all right? Yeah. Yeah, that's a pretty good distribution. Uh, it's gonna fall off on its own again. I can only see its ass right now, but I'll take your word for it. There, oh, there it goes. That's that looks, nice. That looks pretty good. It's pretty nice. That's pretty good. I actually gonna have a second piece all since right. we have to wait a little bit. Now, Domino's, this is going to be a little controversial, I already know, but I'm giving it an A tier as opposed to S, even though on the day of pizza eating, this holy day, I do think it was probably my favorite pizza. But the reason I'm not giving it an S tier is because I don't think it's consistently that solid. Like I said, the last time I had it was like two or three years ago, and it was not good at all. It was bad. It was down there with like dumpster trash Pizza Hut shit. But... This time it was good. I don't know if it's going to be this good every time I have it from now on, or if this was just like a special one where they heard, hey, Charles is uh, making a Yelp review of our pizza. Really give him the best pie we got. Get, get the best ingredients out. I don't know what it was, but it was really good. But just because of past experiences, I'm going to assume this was an outlier. So I'm going to give it an A for that reason. So Hungry Howie's and Little Caesars came at the same time, and I thought it was going to be a bloodbath out in my driveway between the two. They rolled up together, dropped it off together. It was... 
Scary. That was. Anything yeah, could have happened. Marcos, not little they, Caesars. They say. Oh, yeah, it's Marcos. Fresh dough made daily. Ooh. That's a big claim to make. Whoa, Whoa. that's some shit. <laughs> <laughs> that actually does. Why is there icing with it? That doesn't look I, like a scam. I had to order eleven dollars worth of stuff. Why did oh, they think we wanted wow. it with the pizza? I, I added. This side looks good, and then it just looks like soup. Well, yeah, because they had yeah. to. Ew. One of those, oh man! One of those halves is supposed to be your ranch half. Oh, that's, that's what it is. This half. So what the fuck happened over here? It's like a landing zone. That's where the sauce hit. Oh, that'll do it. You want to try some icing? Huh? Yeah, I mean we have to now. That's yeah, true. It's in it. the box. Yeah. Well, I got the garlic sauce so you could compare it to Papa John's. Perfect. <laughs> this this used this used oh. to be my favorite pizza when Oof. I was in middle school. What? No, that's right, fine. Just ding, ding. Yeah, we'll just. Mm. There we go. This looks gross. Ready? Yeah. I used to love this till I got food poisoning from it. <laughs> As if that's taking it. Mm. It tastes like puberty again. It tastes like Charlie's puberty again. <laughs> that's a greasy pizza. It is excessively oily. Oh, this just feels disgusting because it's all full of the grease. Yeah, let me get that. Wow, what is that? Oh. That's garlic sauce, Charlie. Garlic butter sauce. Let, let Danny see that. Yeah. It's just grease in a cup. It is actually just cupped grease, yeah. Oh, no. I'm going in! Oh, my God. I'll go in, too. And here's your icing. Oh, 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 wow, wow, wow. <laughs> Oh, well. Mm. That garlic's too hot for him. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> the pizza's fine. The pizza's... That, that is... Oh, yeah. That is a lot yeah, of dip in the icing. <laughs> just a little dip. I'm going in. Oh, I just what the Oh, fuck? it dripped all over my fingers. Thank uh. you. Man. I'm going to have to say they didn't intend for this to go on the pizza, but... Oh. Who <laughs> That's pretty, oh, that. <laughs> pretty good. <laughs> oh, <laughs> That's not bad. It's better than the garlic. <laughs> yeah. I should have ordered one of each. I bet sauces. you the icing will be better on the crust. Yeah, that is innovative. Let me try it on the crust. Don't forget to try your ranch crust too. Right. It's honestly not bad. It's pretty fucking good. <laughs> mm. Alright. Finally some it's some innovation in yeah. the pizza game. Who thought you could just put semen on pizza and make it taste delicious? No. Hungry Howie, that's who. Charlie's gonna start asking for icing every time he gets pizza. <laughs> yeah, do you have any icing back? <laughs> Can I get a birthday cake with this please? <laughs> How is that ranch? It's just burnt. It looks like, yeah, they just burnt the, the seasoning they put on it. Just You can take a bite off of it if you want. I don't care. Oh, there we go. All right. I want to make sure you can still get some. That's a really fluffy set of dough. Are there. we touching? Is that what yeah. you're doing? Yes. Yeah. It tastes burnt. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. It's like, the icing. It's like it. burnt salt. Oh. That's horrendous. Oh, that is overwhelming. Not. Ah! Well, that's not ranch, it's just a bunch of salt. Uh, I'm not joking. <laughs> Somebody try wild. that. Wild. Somebody yeah. try that. Oh my. It's really burnt, it's, too. Yeah. It's like they charred salt and said that's ranch. That's. Is there even any ranch flavor no, in there? No, that's really bad. Ugh. The best thing in this box is the packet of icing. Yeah. You want to try some icing in your Pepsi? Oh. Actually, grab one of the other pizzas and see if it tastes good in the icing. All right. Here. I wonder if it's here, just here. Howie's that works well with it or if it's just the yeah, icing. Take your pick. We've got the racing stuff from different pizza places. That's kind of You want great. Domino's? Yeah, I'll take Domino's. All right, you try Domino's in it. Give me I'll your try. feedback. I'll try. Pizza Hut. If, or um, Papa John's, I meant to say. Yeah, I ate all the pizza. <laughs> <laughs> That should be a staple. I don't know if it's just because I'm on like a sugar demon kick or what, but that is <laughs> yeah, fantastic. Like sugar. Oh! 
<laughs> that was so much sauce in one bite. Oh, just, I'm not going with the sauce. Do the crust, you idiot. Jesus, man. Oh, is that what you did? Yeah. Oh. Well, that's not trying the pizza in it. It's trying the crust in it. Well, there's pizza. Wow, in sugar on bread is good. <laughs> Mm. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, but I'll try the pizza. I mean, Charlie just wants more sugar. Yeah, I've, I've got a, I've got a fucking problem. That's the thing, though, to do like cinnamon sugar bread with icing, yeah. like that. So that makes sense that it's good. Is it here? Instead of bread sauce, can you just smear icing into the bread? <laughs> can you put some sprinkles on it? Hungry Howie's was a lot to take in. Like I said, it used to be my favorite pizza in middle school, and then I had a bout of food poisoning from it. But when we ordered this pizza, when we did pizza, we wanted it to all be kind of uniform in cheese. But Hungry Howie's, in order to meet the threshold of the payment, we had to split it from cheese to ranch bread. So half is cheese, half is ranch bread, so I'm going to grade them each individually. The cheese pizza, I think, is just a C tier. It's a forgettably average, not good pizza. So like a little below average, but I think C is still pretty applicable. But when it comes to the ranch crust, whatever fucking abomination that is, that's an F. The ranch crust from Hungry Howie's was absolutely terrible. It was just like a handful of salt and a handful of pepper if they were cremated into like a piece of bread. It was not good at all. And then the last thing I'm going to grade from Hungry Howie's, and I think this is the real banger. This is like the actual chemical X in the formula, the icing. I had never even considered it, but they do icing packets, so dipping the crust in the icing was an incredible treat. That's an S tier all day. That, that I think, right there changed the pizza game forever. You don't like Marcos? Oh, I don't know that I've ever even had Marcos. Is it good? Uh, Most loved pizza. Oh, That's a bold claim. The Italian way. Whoa! I don't like mm. when it's melted in the middle like that. I don't that. either. It's like Papa John's if it was like fresher, it seems. Yeah. It looks suspiciously mm -hmm. like Papa John's. Pizza. Yeah. I'm, I'm not. not oh, you go first. <laughs> we might be saying the same thing. I was going to say, I'm not convinced it's not Papa That's John's. That's literally what I was saying. <laughs> yeah. We've melted into one unit. Yeah. Men can coffee, only snack yeah. so much pizza without becoming the same. They were Vulcan mind melding <laughs> through the pizza slaps. They have some, the same nightmares as you. Yeah, there is some like excessive seasoning on this actually. So yeah. it's Papa John's plus perhaps a bit of Domino's. It feels more bread like. It's a little weightier, yeah. Maybe wait, wait, wait. Give me. Maybe it's just fresher made. Yeah, there we go. I don't know why I made that sound in my head. Oh. Reminds me of the Qzar. Remember Qzar mm -hmm. laser tag? Mm -hmm. They used to have pizza. It reminds me of that. It probably was that. Yeah. I used to make the Qzar pizza. It wasn't this. <laughs> Did you really? You worked at Qzar? Uh, they gave me free games for making pizza. <laughs> Matt used to live at Cusar. He was a professional there, laser. There tag was player. one summer where I was nasty at Cusar. Yeah. It's pretty. It's pretty good. It's fine. It's, it's not insulting. Mm -hmm. Cheese very chewy, oh, very airy. Stop with the pizza. <laughs> Is that Chuck E. Cheese? Yeah. I hope it's the actual best. <laughs> Can you imagine if every pizza they sent out comes with the mask? Yeah. <laughs> What's the name of the mascot? Chester? Chucky. It's Chuck. It is Chuck. Yeah, Chuck E. Cheeses. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, it's just shit, yeah. This was probably their first order since quarantine started in March. It's fine. I would put this in a solid, like, C plus range. I'm thinking C as well. The crust yeah. is also pretty not. It's just so bland. But what does it taste like in icing? <laughs> it's canceled evident. Okay. All right, let's see. Yeah, pretty good in the icing. I, I have a strong hunch that everything will be. <laughs> Marco's Pizza. Yeah, that's a C tier all day. That is a innocent slice of pie, but it's nothing that you're going to be super happy that you ate. It's just going to be one of those filler meals. You'll just be like, yep, I got some calories in me, and I wasn't sick from it. So I mean, that's a C tier, baby. Little Caesars. What's their slogan? Delivery, delivery. <laughs> Isn't it pizza, pizza? It's pizza, pizza. Oh. Yeah. Oh, that's the one I got. Pulsa, pulsa. Yeah, that guy. Yeah. That's fucking weird. <laughs> yeah. You mean Caesar? <laughs> is that who that is? I think yeah, so. I, think so. <laughs> I would assume it's Little Caesar. Uh -oh. Oh, I don't hate the color of the crust. It looks pretty good. Yeah, Wait, I what? wish it was a little 
less puffy, but it's looking pretty solid. Yeah, it looks fine. Here. I've never had Little Caesars, I don't think. You have. All right, I guess I have. No, Idiot. so... I don't remember that at all. And you got a ton of chicken. <laughs> it's disgusting. You went to Little Caesars and got shaky. Yeah, I, I got, I that guess. sounds like Charlie. That's the only thing that would be We went to Little Caesars. Oh, We're going to Little Caesars. What do you want? Can you just give me like 40 chicken nuggets? Do they have scallops? <laughs> All right. Yeah. This one can be slapped if you yeah. want. Nice. I don't know how to feel. I'm not a big fan. Yeah, it's kind of weird. It's like really plastic. Pizza, pizza. How much was this one? Um, is that the one that came with? No, that wasn't the one that came with drinks, was it? No. 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 That was six dollars. I I was gonna say if this was more than six dollars, it deserves a refund. Well, I think it ended up being like fifteen <laughs> with tip and delivery taxes. That pizza was six dollars, and it came out with fifteen. It's it's definitely the cheapest pizza we've it, eaten. It today. actually tastes like I'm eating two dollars. That's not good pizza. It's re it's not, it, it feels like they took like the plastic displays and then heated them up. I remember getting this in high school and I used to enjoy it, but this is it's the crust. Whatever the crust is is really bad. I argue it's the cheese. Like, watch this. <laughs> you see that? Mm-hmm. Oh, I thought you were gonna like eat it. Nope. <laughs> That's the whole Here, demonstration. You know what? We will we'll test parts. Because there's a funky taste in there. Yeah, it's gross. I it's think it's part of the sauce. Chewing I, the cheese feels like I'm chewing bubble gum. Well, I've been eating like the whole piece of each one. And there is no redeeming quality about this pizza. No, it's definitely not good. Well, we haven't tried it in icing yet. <laughs> <laughs> I will tell you, Papa John's was worse in icing than the others. There's, I think this will be a good in icing. That might be the best in icing. Yeah. It's like the most cakey kind of bread. Yeah. It's really compact. Yeah. There's so there's limited sauce A mm -hmm. and B the cheese is like stiff. Like you real were right stiff. the weird taste is the cheese. Yeah, it's, it's not, not the good. bread. No. The bread's fine. Yeah. The bread tastes like the bread that everybody else serves with cheese sticks. Yeah. It's like that slightly more compact dense bread. Yeah, that's pretty not good. Whenever we do these, I act like I know what the fuck I'm talking about. <laughs> you convinced me. Little Caesars was not good. Uh, probably one of the worst of the day. Little Caesars was shockingly not good. But not, like, offensively terrible. It's not something that I'd eat in projectile vomit. It's just something I'd eat and be disappointed that I ate at all. It's just a waste of a meal. For that reason, Little Caesars, it's going to be comfortably in the D tier. My hypothesis is that this is our number one. You think so? I loved Chuck E. Cheese pizza as a kid, but I was also four. Yeah. <laughs> I used to... <laughs> so, yeah. Tamper. Evidence. I do like there's a tamper-proof yep. seal on it. You know, sure I've always wondered... Chuck didn't get in but what I've always thing. wondered <laughs> on restaurants is what these do, because the only people I'm worried about touching the food between them and me is them, and they have to touch it well, to put just, it in the if box. if the guy gets robbed... I guess that's and he, true. Like, and then he still <laughs> brings the pizza. He gets the pizza back. Right. And it's, he wrestles yeah. it out of the mugger's hands. You can take my wallet, but not Chuck E. Cheese's yeah. pie. Oh, yeah. Put that with my but, man. Yeah, that is... Oh, oh. bad. Oh. That looks really bad. That's not what that it was like when not, I was a kid. That doesn't look normal. This looks really fucking awful. That's like an overload of... It's like a cracker. They put a lot of oregano on that crust. Yeah, I can smell it actually. It's oppressive. It hurts my nose. Well, maybe it all comes together really well. Yeah, maybe. It is... Yeah, it is like a cracker. It peels nicely. It does have... It feels like peel. they ran it through their ticket machine. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, you want to get a little... Yeah, we can just... Yeah. Mm. Really meld it. Thanks. Oh, it tastes better than it looks immediately. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No, it doesn't as much. <laughs> the aftertaste is bad. I will tell you 100% this is not the pizza they used to have when I was a kid. They had the one that they cooked it on those trays that make the little lumps on the bottom, the little balls. I don't know what you're talking about. I know what he means. Sam's Club has it on the bottom of theirs too. They got these little balls on the bottom of the pizza. This is a weird pizza. I don't like it. But I don't hate it. Yeah, it's weird. I like it. 
you think they use like tranquilizer in it since it's for kids? Like Chuck E. Cheese sneaks in oh, roofies or something? Like yeah, keep maybe. the kids calm? Yeah, keep the camera rolling for the next hour. Let's see what happens. <laughs> yeah. Charlie just like pass. <laughs> I think my biggest problem is with the crust. You just, did you forget where you were? What happened? <laughs> no, so like I didn't like Little Caesars, but let me let me show you something. Oh, you're onto something. With Little Caesars, here, here's a piece of crust. You can see with the bread, the little air pockets in there. Yeah. They let it rise, like it actually had room to grow. This. No, you see what no man should have to see. There's nothing. There's. It didn't rise. It's it, a, like you said, Danny. It's a cracker. It actually does feel kind of like that. It's just. Okay, but I like thin crust, so maybe. I but like it doesn't it. like thin crust gets crispy. This is like. Yeah. This is like. If you rose pizza and then sliced it. Yeah. Trying to double the or like double the amount of pizzas mm -hmm. they make with the same amount of dough, probably. I'm no confidence that that crust would taste good in icing either. <laughs> Harsh. I know. That's a bold claim. I mean, it's not terrible, but it's not good. Yeah, it's fine. No. It's, I don't know if this is my least favorite or Little Caesars. Uh, Little Caesars. For Little Caesar. Yeah, yeah, I think you're right. This one at least doesn't taste funky. Mm -hmm. It feels a little funky. <laughs> But yeah, it doesn't taste funky. <laughs> it gets that's the drop sticking in. I, I really hope that you agree with this or I'll sound weird. But there's a moment, like, as I'm going to swallow the pizza, where the consistency makes no sense in my head. It's like... What the fuck are you talking it's about? It's really, really fucking dense. I don't know. It's just pizza, Matt. It doesn't feel like I'm eating pizza. Wait, what is it? Feel? What are you experiencing? <laughs> this man's going through the avatar state of pizza. <laughs> Last and almost least is Chuck E. Cheese's pizza. It's not as bad as Little Caesars, but it is not good either. There is almost nothing redeeming about Chuck E. Cheese pizza except for the fact that you can see a giant fucking rat when you're there eating it in person, I suppose. I'm giving it a C tier because it's not as bad as Little Caesars, and it's just not terrible in the first place. It's not horrible. And yeah, that's all the pizzas that we could find that I think most people would recognize at least. So these are exactly where they should be in terms of the tier list. And uh, yeah, that's about it. So yeah.